so friends welcome back now let's talk about the uh, replication of single stranded dna viruses well there is example i have uh, talked in the previous uh, class that the example of single stranded dna viruses is a parvo viruses and here you can see that it is a linear uh, single stranded dna viruses there is another types of uh, single stranded dna viruses that is circular and it is ubiquitous human virus let me write ubiquitous human virus very small virus okay now these two viruses are the example of uh, single stranded dna virus now what will happen uh, how it will replicate let's talk about it obviously the process of attachment and penetration and uh, the release of genome from the capsid will be same obviously endosomal lysosomal enzyme will degrade this uh, capsomer of this capsid and dna single stranded dna will come out of the uh come out of this endosome and now what will happen this single stranded dna it will get enter into the nucleus now in the nucleus we need to make rna so that protein synthesis can take place but you know that rna polymerase cannot work on single stranded dna so it means this single stranded dna first of all it have to convert into a, a double stranded dna so that transcription can take place and rna can form so obviously with the help of uh, uh, host enzymes it will convert into double stranded uh, dna virus uh, double stranded dna okay now this double stranded dna will use host enzyme for the transcription rna polymerase it will use rna polymerase and rna polymerase will cause the transcription and in as a result of transcription different messenger rnas will be formed messenger rnas will be formed okay now these messenger rna they will go out of the nucleus and they will attach on the ribosome as a result protein synthesis will take place and different proteins will be formed different protein will be formed in the cytoplasm now again we need to uh, replicate uh, this dna and we know that the original genome of this virus is single stranded dna so obviously we need single stranded dna copies so now what will happen uh, it will use again dna polymerase and from this double stranded dna single stranded dna copies will be formed single, single stranded dna copies will be formed so there will be lots of single stranded dna copies will be will be made in the into the nucleus now these uh, dna copies they will again come out of the nucleus and they will come into the cytoplasm okay and into the in the cytoplasm the assembly of virus will take place proteins are there genome is there so obviously assembly of virus will take place and an exact copy of virus will be single stranded virus will be formed so this is the process by which single stranded uh, dna viruses get replicated okay i hope uh, now you are quite clear about the concept of replication in single stranded dna viruses and in double stranded dna viruses as well about the double stranded dna viruses i have explained in the previous video please uh, visit my dad video i have explained approximately all the uh, possible mechanism that a double stranded dna can uh, use for the uh, replication in the next video we will talk about the replication of rna viruses please stay with me